Salut nos partisans, c'est Nick Bopov. Je suis heureux de répondre à certaines des questions que nos partisans peuvent avoir. Alors avec Martin Lapointe, nous sommes responsables de la constitution de liste de repêchage de la sélection des joueurs pour les Canadiens de Montréal. Alors, euh, la partie la plus, plus amusante de mon travail est voir la croissance de ces, de ces enfants. Euh, depuis le moment où nous euh, les voyons aujourd'hui, euh, euh, ici, euh, comme Van, et jusqu'au euh, vrai euh, euh, joueur de la Ligue nationale. Uh, all the kids who play internationally usually play different tournaments uh, around the world. Obviously, uh, uh, pre-COVID, uh, it was easier to see them on different ice sheets. Uh, but uh, by and large, these are the kids that uh, are playing on their national team. They travel around the world, they play on different side surfaces, and it's uh, relatively easy to gauge them because they uh, switch from surface to surface and uh, Uh, they've learned to adjust because they've been doing it since they were little kids tra traveling the world uh, for their respective teams, national teams. Uh, so they're used to it and uh, we're used to it as well. Alors, nous, uh, salut, nous recherchons uh, la résilience du caractère, uh, uh, le sens du hockey et uh, l'esprit de compétition. Euh, c'est très important euh, pour, euh, pour les joueurs, pour les Canadiens, donc euh, c'est très important pour nous. Euh, et mon français, euh, euh, je n'ai pas parlé français depuis 20 ans, donc euh, ça va prendre quelques mois à, à le ramener à la vie, à le ramener à nouveau approprié euh, pour cette franchise, mais euh, j'ai étudié à l'université et j'ai joué avec euh, beaucoup euh, de joueurs, coéquipières, Québécois, donc, euh, euh, mais ça fait, ça, ça fait 20 ans. Oh, I think my favorite part about analyzing players is to try to uh, look into their soul uh, because we see these kids on the ice, we see them in different situations, uh, and now we get to interview uh, them and uh, to ask them about their families, uh, their backgrounds, and some come from very unique backgrounds that uh, if you don't talk to the kid, you don't realize uh, how difficult it was uh, to travel this path and end up here at the Combine. So uh, we'll try to dig in and uh, maybe open up their heart a little bit and uh, see what they're made of. Well, the Canadians have had a lot of draft picks over the course of the last uh, few years and obviously have made uh, uh, very good selections. Um, we've had uh, kids like Joshua, uh, who's done uh, phenomenally well in the Quebec League, uh, uh, Riley Kidney, uh, Gouley, uh, a great defenseman playing in the playoffs right now, uh, Arbor Jekai in Hamilton in the Ontario League, uh, playing in the playoffs, but also some kids in the American League, like Ilonen, uh, Heinemann that we uh, traded for in the Florida deal. So there are a lot of kids who are coming and uh, the times will be exciting. The Habs was the first team I ever saw live when I was growing up in the Soviet Union in Leningrad. And uh, the team that won the 93 Stanley Cup came to Leningrad in 1989 and I went to their practice and I saw for the first time great players like Patrick Voix and Guy Carbonneau and Shane, Shane Corson uh, and others and uh, I even had a hat that they all signed and it was my first NHL hat and when I uh, moved to Boston um, kids used to try to fight me because I was wearing the Canadian's hat so I guess you can say I've always been a Habs fan since I was a little